yesterday on the BBC, on the Laura Koonsberg show, Braverman insists that Rwanda is safe for migrants. They're calling her Cruella from the 101 Dalmatians. She wants to take refugees, people fleeing war, some dead, drowning and dead at the bottom of the sea, fighting for their lives. It's a political tool for power. It's about the culture wars. And they're using these people's, the most vulnerable people. She wants to put them in detention centres and then extraordinarily rendition them to Rwanda. What, strap them into their seats on black handcuffed? What is this? This was after Laura Koonsberg explained to her that like 12 refugees were shot dead. Shot dead by the Rwandan government. By the, She says, I, I never heard of that. <laughs> it was in a report that the US sent you. And she denies that the, the queues at Dover, it's got nothing to do with Brexit. It's nothing to do. <laughs> Fuck's sake. And guess who doesn't have to pay? Asta doesn't have to worry about their electricity and gas bills. Says if Braverman is like a loophole when she's not. She's staying at her mum and dad. She's staying at her parents. It's, <laughs> it's not against the rules. You can make this shit up. People dead drowning in the bottom of the sea. Cruella. That's what they're calling her. What the good state of this country? Grim, shitty little island. Like cut off from the rest of the world. You know, we're an island economy, John Redwood. He says, yeah, just don't worry about it. He says here, what's it say? Staycation. Why not take a holiday break in the UK to avoid the delays in France? Why not, John? Why not? Have you seen the raw Tory sewage? You're pumping into the onto the beaches. <laughs> Why not? <laughs>